Welcome to the Pioneer Library System. I'm Holly from the Newcastle Branch. In today's acrylic painting, I want to show you how you can create this sea turtle, which goes along with the theme for our 2022 Summer Learning Challenge, Oceans of Possibilities. Just another fun initiative from the Pioneer Library System. For this painting, you'll need to gather the following supplies. I use titanium white, phthalo blue, yellow medium, yellow ochre, burnt umber, and vermilion. The brush is medium filbert, a small flat brush, and a very small fine detailed round brush. You'll also want to get a paper plate, some paper towels, and some water. Before we begin, we need to go ahead and sketch our turtle on some paper. I just made an oval with the head coming out, the flippers, and then to do the pattern, I made lines going across the top and then connected those Once you sketch out your picture, you'll want to transfer that onto your canvas. I use this transfer paper. I'm using an 8x10 canvas. So I'll line that up. And just go around the edge of your drawing. We're going to start by making the ocean color. So I'm going to take my blue and some of the white. And I'm going to mix up about a medium blue color. And we're going to use the larger filbert brush and we're going to brush back and forth. Let's darken the water. So we'll take the blue, using it straight out of the tube. We'll paint at the very bottom of the ocean where it doesn't get as much sunlight. So it's going to be a little darker. And then we'll just gradually work our way up. Now we're going to create the waves that we see at the top of the ocean. So let's get some of that white. You can use the same brush and we're just going to make little U-shaped brush strokes. I'm ready to make the sand. Burnt umber and white. It'll be more white then brown. And we're just going to put that along the bottom of the ocean. The light is reflecting down at the bottom of the, the water. We're going to make that right now. I mixed white and blue. Also, let's put a little of that brown sand color in there. Those little marks. You can just pick up blue, you can use a little dark blue, some of the white. I'm ready to paint my turtle. I made my own green and I'm going to leave it loosely mixed. Take some of the blue and yellow ochre and some white. We're going to paint the turtle in the direction of the pattern. So I'm using a small flat brush and we'll let the, the colors mix on the canvas, creating an interesting color pattern. Now I'm going to go around the edge of the shell using small strokes with a small flat brush, still um, grabbing different colors as I go. So it'll mix on the canvas, creating interesting varying greens. Let's make this green even lighter by adding some, some more white to it, maybe a little yellow. And let's make the color for the flippers and the head. I 
I'm going to take my small round brush and we're going to make that sand color again, some tan. Go back and find your pattern. Fill those in. Take some of that brown with the end of your brush. Make some little dots on his flippers. Let's make the eye color. You can use black or I like to mix my own with a little brown and blue. Put your mouth in. Now I'm going to paint the starfish. I'm using the vermilion. I'm going to add just a small amount of white to that for where the light might be hitting it. Now I'm darkening it and making a little shadow underneath. Once you put your starfish on, you can add some sea grasses. I'm just mixing my own green with some blue and this yellow. And you can leave that loosely mixed. And then take the edge of your brush and just make some little squiggly lines going up. You can even add a little bit of white. So blue and yellow creates green. Now if you want, you can add a little yellow, some yellow fish. Gonna take some white paint on a stylus and make a little dot on the eye to give it a shiny look. Then you can take your very small brush and some white paint that is thinned down and make some little bubbles. You can add little stripes. Thanks for joining the Pioneer Library System today. I hope you had fun painting your sea turtle. For further exploration on the subjects of acrylic painting or sea turtles, check out these always available books on Hoopla with your library card. And so you don't miss a single episode, be sure to like and subscribe below. Mm -hmm.